Hey guys, what's going on? This is Coach Justin from Ultimate Baseball Training. In this video, I wanted to share with you how to properly field the ground ball. It sounds really basic, it sounds super easy and simple, but yet there's a lot of younger players out there that don't know how to field the ground ball properly. So I wanna kinda dispel any myths and misconceptions there is out there and show you the easiest way to field the ground ball, specifically that's hit right at you in this video. So the very first thing you gotta think about is your footwork. How do we actually approach a ground ball? Um, the first thing is you don't want to just sprint right up to the ball and field it and then first base is over there and I'm stuck. I feel it here and I have no momentum. Okay, so that's the very first thing you've, you've maybe heard of the term rounding the baseball before. That's what we want to try and do. So if this is the baseball here that I'm fielding, move this to the side, we're going to use that in a second, but if this is the baseball I'm fielding, I don't want to sprint up to it and field it and have my feet at a standstill. Instead, what I want to do if it's hit directly at me is I want to take, a, 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 I'm a right-handed thrower, my gloves on my left-hand side, so I'm going to take a couple steps this way, okay, I'm going to get around the baseball, you know, not a banana route, but just a couple steps so I can get a little bit around the baseball and I'm going to go right, left. Then I'm gonna feel the ball slightly on my glove hand side, okay? If you just hang your arms down naturally, that's kind of where your glove is. So you wanna feel it slightly on your glove hand side. Now, once you feel the baseball, then the footwork becomes right, a step through with your right, and then left, okay? So it's right, left, catch, right, left, throw. I'm gonna demonstrate that really quick. And just working slightly around the baseball, okay? So I'm getting in my ready position, ball's hit at me, right, left, catch, right, left, throw, okay? Um, it's important that you want to, uh, when you when you feel the ball and you step through, you want to stay low. I see a lot of people kind of come up like this. We want to stay low and in an athletic position. So that's how you feel the ground ball, okay? As far as posture is concerned, we're going to go right, left, and we're going to watch the ball all the way into our glove. Our hands are going to be out in front of us, okay? Not going to be down directly like this. Out in front of us, our, our back is going to be relatively flat, okay, like this. We don't want to be up like this because if the ball takes a bad hop, it's maybe gonna hit me in the face. We don't want that, right? So you wanna have pretty much a flat back, okay? Your eyes, your nose down watching the ball, your glove out in front of you and this hand on top, just like that. Boom, watch the ball all the way. And when you catch it, you wanna, you wanna funnel everything in to your body like this, okay? So that's how you properly feel the ground ball. Now, let's do a drill without actually getting any ground balls hit to us. Let's do a drill to really enforce this footwork. So I have a regular baseball here. I also have a soccer ball, but you can use another glove. You can use a Gatorade bottle, whatever. You're gonna put it directly behind this baseball a couple feet. Now, this soccer ball, what I'm gonna do, what that's gonna represent is that's where I get into my ready position. So whether you do a little creep step like this or whether you kind of hit your glove and do a do a hop I'm okay with either one of those but what we're gonna do when we get to that soccer ball we're gonna get ready boom and that's gonna resemble the ball being hit then we're gonna get around this soccer ball okay not go straight over the top of it get around the soccer ball and then right left act like we feel this baseball here step through stay low and then make a throw towards our target okay so just like this the ready position boom. And that's how you do that drill. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed this. Um, I guarantee if you practice this, you're gonna have solid fielding mechanics, okay? So this is how you properly field the ground ball. If you've enjoyed this video, if you've learned a little bit from it, make sure you leave a thumbs up. Also, get in the comment section below. Let me know what you want me to make future videos about. And as always, if you're not already, be sure to hit that subscribe button right there. You'll automatically be notified whenever we release new videos. So hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.